thinking about the silent movie era. Do see, mm. uh, you know, the silent movies with the, the music, the speech cards, the comedy, custard pies, all of that. And it struck us. Surely the hardest thing of all to do in the silent movie era would have been to have a talk show, okay? It'd be very hard to do, wouldn't it? And see, now you're, in, yeah, you're agreeing. Yes. <laughs> so, we thought we'd give it a go. So, uh, we've got a silent movie effect and music. <laughs> so, you understand what's going on, yes? You're following us. Okay, so. Uh, what we're going to do is we're just, we're just going to mine and the speech cards uh, will do the work for us. Are you following this? Can this technically be considered a now acting with Robert Downey Jr.? Can we...? <laughs> yes, you can. Yes. 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 yes! What degree from Kevin Bacon are you then? <laughs> I can know where I am in the game now. <laughs> just, just don't drop the ball. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm, I'm, okay, I'm fine. <laughs> okay. Here we go. down on my feet. <laughs> <laughs> Your designer shoes. Thank you. <laughs> now, to be, to, be, to be... Oh, we've got other things here. Let, let, you know... Let's help poor man who's just had a pie thrown yeah, in his face. Quite, quite. Yeah. You, you, you want to talk about humility. It's one thing to take the pie in the face and then have him say cut. It's another thing to have hundreds of people here watching after the fact. Let's hear it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, Jack, Jack, Jack. Here we go. There you go. It's part of that mirror. Can I help him? Yes, of course you can. Come here, Skitty. This is not beautiful. Come on. Right between your eyes and stuff, too. Oh. Yes. You're going to be doing your trousers. Your trousers. There you go. You ready? You ready to move on? No, I'm All right, it is time to be our musical guest tonight. He was one of the first stars to emerge from a reality music show, and he's still a pop idol. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Mr. Will Young! <laughs> Sing in a minute. Yes, you are. I, uh, want, I want to be pied so you can <coughs> wipe it off my face. <laughs> uh, Precious <laughs> moments. <laughs> Beautiful. And uh, now, listen, you're here uh, to do a job. What are you going to be singing for us in a minute? Uh, you and I. You and I? Yeah. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. And uh, this is from a uh, new uh, greatest hits. 
Yeah, I know. It makes me feel really old. Yeah, well, it, it makes you seem really old. <laughs> <laughs> I am really old. Um, now, obviously we know a lot about you. We know you're a lovely singer and everything. But what you may not know, well, you probably don't know anything about Will Young, but uh, what, what a lot of people may not know about Will Young is he's a little bit psychic. A little bit psychic. A little bit clear. Oh, I am a little bit psychic. Yeah. See? Okay. Yes, I am. <laughs> What? You said you were a little bit sick. I couldn't. Uh, <laughs> I like, I like I the way. A little bit sick you know, as well. <laughs> I've got a runny tummy. It's horrible. <laughs> oh, it's really horrible. That's that's why he's down that end. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Near the tissues and towels. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Just there you go. Uh, so, uh, although you are a little psychic, you didn't expect me to ask you that. No. But, uh, but you are, <laughs> yeah. In fact, I wrote it down. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. so what have you predicted yeah. so far, I William? I, I, okay. okay, I predicted um, Pop Idol. What, what did you predict I predicted about Pop Idol? that I would, I would win a competition for a singer. Okay, and you did do that. And I did. Yes. Um, uh, I predicted that I would do a film in the 19, based in the 1930s with Judi Dench, and I did. What? And he did yeah, And that. I wrote it down. I did write it down. Yeah, not just um, messing, not making this up. I'm not making it up. <laughs> And I, and I predicted that I'd do a Noel Coward play. And you did? Yeah. Is and that... that I'd meet Robert Downey Jr. <laughs> <laughs> no, you didn't. No, I didn't. No, I, didn't. No. I saw it in the credits. <laughs> <laughs> but tell me this, tell me this. Concentrate now. Look okay. into the future. Ooh. Yeah. Very... He's a singer. <laughs> <laughs> Don't we know it? Yeah. Sing, sing, <laughs> sing, sing, sing. I'm a singer. Yeah. Um, <laughs> uh, who? Who do you think is going to win next factor? Oh, I, I see. I, I think um, I think Joe will win X Factor. Yeah. Well, this show goes out on Mondays at half ten, so you will either look like a genius yeah. or a bit of a dick. Yeah. <laughs> can we just? Can we do? I think Ollie will win. <laughs> I think Stacy will win. <laughs> Very good. I think Danny Minogue will win. <laughs> But it's interesting now, because looking back, because you won the first pop idol in yeah. 2002. Yeah. Um, do you think nowadays, the way these shows are kind of produced and constructed, that someone like you, sort of, you know, a posh, middle class, educated boy, do yeah. you think it would be possible for you to win one of those shows now? Well, I mean, I, th I think. Well, I, actually, I know you still I, sing. No, no, I think, <laughs> yeah. I think what it was, for me, I was, I was posh, I really wasn't, and I'm not very cool, you know. Uh, gay, I, I think it would have been hard for me to go into a record company and go, go on, give us a deal. <laughs> so actually, um, you won't regret it. Um, so, so actually, I think for me it was a great thing. And yes, uh, now I, I hope that it still would. Because it's about singing, you know, and, and I sang, but I, did, I didn't really know what else to do. Now, in fairness, talking about the class thing, I thought you'd lost it in the semi-final when they filmed your home no, visit. Was, yeah. And you went back and you were an Arga. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to vote for him now. <laughs> He's already living the dream. <laughs> there was a... There was a... Yes, I pull up in my golf. Hi, Mummy. Um, <laughs> there was an awful thing they did of me and Gareth in our houses, and they had... They had Gareth's house, which was which was smaller than my house, and then our house, which they sort of elongated, <laughs> and my with my mum's face looking through the window, why the ducks were disturbed at the end of the garden. <laughs> it was the Daily Mail photographer. <laughs> it was awful. Well, it was she, awful. Maybe she just like Graham. She was delighted that her house was going to be on film. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so.